Now look at this, y'all. Hey, look at this, man. You see, that's Maurice's link in there the whole time. That's where he moved it to. It used to be closer to the back, man. The other car I want y'all pay attention to is right up here, that white one. Hey, I want y'all to hit the like button, subscribe. Hey, shout out to whoever this channel is, man. Like, salute, you know? Yeah, we want to salute, man. We all working together to get justice for Dolph, man. So, man, right there, you can see it's the dude going through Dolph Trunk. He's getting that Chrome Heart backpack that he had, that little, you know how everybody nowadays, they be wearing them little fanny packs and everything across their chest. Well, Dolph had a super expensive one. It's Chrome Heart. It's the same one he had at Ruth Chris, the same one he had at the clinic. And in there was a lot of money. It's a lot of money in there. How much money do you think you could fit in there if they're all hundreds? stacked like that that's what they just came and took out of that trunk like you just saw the dude that's literally his head is right above the lincoln and that's and he is standing right behind the corvette how did they get the corvette they already had the keys to it because young Dolph brother drove it up the guy y'all called the security guard he he actually drove that car yeah he drove the he literally was the one the main I, look the main chess player in this game and y'all gotta look at the fact that we don't want people to look at it from a negative this like really like a negative perspective y'all gotta look at it from an open-minded perspective and open-minded view it's gonna show y'all exactly what's going on if you look in the video like pay attention to this man yeah yeah Man, and that's crazy because a lot of people missed missed it at first. And you can see right here, man, his his swollen uh face right above his eye. They didn't they didn't photoshop that good enough. We could tell that it's some like deformities that he had on him, man. They were covering up. The most obvious thing is right over his left eye. It's gonna be on the right side of your screen. You see how he has the swollenness right over the eyebrow. That's unnatural. He doesn't have that in the pictures of him with the jewelry on and the yellow and all. Like he doesn't have that in the one where he was uh he was there the last time. So y'all gotta look at the fact that this wasn't even really like, man, it was too much going on in these videos. And why is he, why is he looking like that? Why is the man looking like that? Just the whole factor. Like, why is they so quick to put out pictures and videos of him to the fact of what happened? And you see how he's his eyes, he's not even looking at the lens. He's looking at some something in the back or either like looking like he's not actually paying attention because he could have already been gone and they stood him up. They sent him up. But pay attention, pay attention to the way his arm is over her shoulder. You're going to see that same arm later. You see that arm? If you pay attention to the arm. It's sticking up, right, with the fingers. Did shout out to finger? this channel, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, shout out to that channel. You see how his finger is pointing up? You're going to see his arm from this scene used in the arm with the window. We're gonna show it to y'all. Man, and this guy was really wearing a blue hoodie. That's crazy because they were throwing off the description of the suspects to get you to think that all the people around there are looking for one person when it was really somebody else. And that was Maurice in the background. And Maurice was the main one. Exactly, man. Man, it's out there, man. The whole thing is the fact that that white car was there to begin with. Somebody drove it up because they had them dings in the bumper like they had gotten into it with something right before. Like, who is that? How come those people never came out and moved their car? 
that car ended up getting towed. Hey, the same thing that y'all saw is right here. You see how that arm and the finger is sticking up just like the way it is in the picture of the Ruth Chris. And they conveniently only released it so his arm is in the corner of the picture. This is supposed to be a widescreen security camera because remember ADT, they said that they got the ADT upgraded 4K. Well, those 4K cameras you could purchase from their packages are widescreen. So it would have showed you inside the window, but they chopped it up and put the same arm that was over the lady's shoulder at the Ruth Chris because it had the watch on and the finger sticking the same way. The gap between his thumb and his index finger is the same. And they just placed it and rotated it to make it look like it's sticking out the window. And Makita Raven moved his leg to the right. Like, y'all got to understand, by her even touching him, that literally, like, altered the whole scene. Y'all got to look at the fact that Raven played a big part in what's going on. And she did the interviews saying subliminal things about whatever happened with the Dolph thing. And she wanted people to continue to believe one thing when really something new came out. After something new came out, that's when she wanted people to go back to the previous thing. Why was she so big on that? Like, you got to understand, she was there. She the one helped. She the one grabbed his leg. You got to understand this, man. Those are her people that did this. And uh, everything shows. You, ha you have to look at the fact. Yeah, they had to move the body like that to put him into that area of the front so that when the, the firefighter guy and all the paramedic guys pull up, that they can get him from right over there so everybody thinks it happened right over there. Whole time, when they moved him like that, they didn't even get the arm out the window that good enough. They had to release this picture with extra edits. Like, it wasn't even exactly the same as what they were doing when they moved it. Hey, what's up? Hey, unmute your thing. I did. I unmuted.